Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with Docker. Our viewer is using an application that runs on three different Docker images, a server with a REST API, RabbitMQ, and a worker. They want to scale this application by running multiple independent instances of it while also implementing a load balancer like Haproxy to manage traffic. However, they face challenges with scaling and maintaining independence between these instances. Let's dive into the details and explore potential solutions together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully you find that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To run multiple instances of your application independently, we can use Docker Compose with multiple Compose files. This allows you to define separate services for each instance of your application. In each Compose file, define the services for your application. For instance, you can specify the server, RabbitMQ, and worker for each instance. Make sure to use different ports for each service to avoid conflicts. Next, you can start each instance using the command docker compose f docker compose app1.yml up for the first instance and docker compose f docker compose 2.yml up for the second instance. This way, each application runs independently. To manage traffic between these instances, you can set up Haproxy as a load balancer. Configure Haproxy to route requests to the different instances based on the defined ports. Lastly, if you want to scale further, consider using Kubernetes. Kubernetes allows you to manage multiple containers as pods, providing better orchestration and scaling capabilities. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To run multiple Docker Compose files, you can use a .env file. Set the Compose file variable to include all your YAML files like a.yaml and c.yaml. Once you've set that up, simply run the command docker compose up to start all the services defined in those files. Here's how your project structure should look with the .nv file and your YAML files in the same directory. And that's it guys. I hope you found the answer that you're looking for and got to that resolution in the end. If you did, please take a moment, hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. Until the next time you need more technical videos, I hope you have a great day. Cheers.